Tiller King's Hispanic Chamber of Commerce Installation Awards. And our next category is the business that is zero to 10 employees. And the nominees are Mikey, the next person is uh, Nate Winger from State Farm Agency, How We Roll Ice Cream, and they have delicious ice cream, I think one. The Small Business of the Year is... And you can get a selfie with Jake from State Farm. <laughs> He's there now. <clears throat> Thank you. I'm I'm really humbled by this, and I <laughs> I've loved being a State Farm agent. I've been with State Farm for 10 years now. Just celebrated 10 years last month, and <clears throat> I'm incredibly thankful for. A, an amazingly supportive wife through all of this, Aaron. Also, Jesus Christ, my Savior, who who has given me more grace than I could ever possibly deserve. Um, my five kids love um, that I'm a safe from Asia. My little Charlie is three. She calls my office Nate Farm. She thinks it's called Nate Farm, and so that's what she calls it, which we love that. Yeah. Um, and I'm also thankful for our community. A lot of our community, including many of you, have put your trust in me and my team to protect the things that you have, help you realize your dreams. I love State Farm. This is our 100th anniversary. I believe deeply in State Farm. I chose to be their, an agent for them because I think they're the best company out there. But more than that, my team, I believe in them. I have four um, team members. Most of them have been with me for almost the time I opened. And Carlos is one of them. You guys know Carlos. I am so blessed that Carlos works in my office. So if you can imagine, we have a lot of fun because Carlos is there and he makes our office a ton of fun. Even though he's getting his master's degree and can only work part-time, we love him to death. And um, my, one of my main goals as a State Farm agent from the time I opened was that every single year, as we grew and got better, that I would increase the amount, um, as most of you, most of you business owners do the same thing. This isn't unique to me, but that we would increase the amount we give to our community, um, the percentage that we give to our community. That's very important to me. I love our community. We've had some amazing, my team has inspired most of the ideas of where we give back, and I love that so much. So thank you. And thank you to the chamber. This chamber from the time I opened up has been one of my biggest supports, and I'm so thankful for the Tulare Kings Hispanic Chamber of Commerce. And your medium business of the year for 2022, Bring all the Fall Calls and Down LLC. Everybody else, I didn't have anything prepared. Um, thank you to the chamber. We've been chamber members for a long time, and um, we've had a lot of uh, business come from the chamber, but we've also made a lot of good friends from the chamber. Uh, so it's very nice to see everybody again. Um, Dr. Luis Gonzalez, I, I, I can't express enough how we agree with um, her story. Uh, one of the things that we have done at, at the firm, we're the, we're the biggest um, law firm in, in Kings Artillery County. And one of the things that we've done is establish our own community foundation. Uh, we've had, um, excuse me, we had 30 high school students um, last week to come in and just give them an education about what we do and give them exposure 
um, because <clears throat> as Dr. Gonzalez said, it's a, a real small number for um, bachelor's degrees. It's an even smaller number for uh, doctorate degrees. And so we just want to expose the kids. If you know any kids, we're happy to have them. We do internships um, at all kinds of levels. So um, if anybody knows anybody interested in the law, send them our way, we're happy to have them. So thank you. Business of the year is all system solars. Just apologize for uh, I'm really loud, so I don't even need a microphone. <laughs> Those of you that know me. Um, I, I, I'm absolutely amazed by this. Uh, I didn't expect it. And I, I'm one of those people that's busy enough to easily get surprised. And I found out today that there was some kind of an award thing because, because one of my staff had to write something about it. But um, I'm grateful for the Hispanic Chamber. I am an absolute advocate for the Hispanic Chamber and the Hispanic community. And, um, and, 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 and really, I thought it, I, I got this for some, for some stuff I did in Parlier, but, but uh, I, I had no idea that, that this was gonna happen. Um, I believe in the power of the Hispanic Chamber and the Hispanic community. And, and, and try to educate everybody I go, everywhere I go, that, you know, Spanish was spoken for a hundred years in California before English was the primary language. And, you know, most people don't know that and don't think about it. And um, I, I, there's, there's, I'm out of words, but thank you very much.